So my favorite app in the whole world, maybe top five as it relates to houses, is this how this app right here. If you want to, uh, if you want to say put up a fence in your backyard and you want a fancy fence, you go to house, you search, you do a. They have millions of photos, literally millions of photos, and people upload their photos of neat things. And if you say I want an exterior fence or I want a cedar gate, or I want, um, you know, a soaker tub bathroom, uh, you type that in and they'll show you like a million pictures. And so you can scan through those pictures real quick and you can see uh, what uh, some of the, um, some of the things are being done. And a lot of times if we're doing nicer houses, we want that. Sometimes I just want to add some bonus or some benefit. I remember one of the houses we did, it was kind of in a, what in a neighborhood full of what I call white elephants, houses that are really bigger than what the market's asking for. And they had, uh, uh, it was fire damaged house. And it was the mar market wasn't near as hot as it is now. And I'd went to a trade show uh, where they had a lot of new features and houses in this one place they had, they had rotating library where you can make a private room. And so we created a private room in this house. It was like a safe room. And, and we made a uh, bookcase that actually, when it was closed, looked like it was built into the wall. But if you pushed on it, it opened up and then it showed the hidden room. When we sold, when we put that house on the market, the average days on market were about 120, 150 days. We had multiple offers on that house because it had that unique feature compared, it kind of made it stand out for other things. So occasionally you'll want to do that. In today's market, we don't really care. I don't think it makes sense to do that.